A Special Teacher Years ago, a John Hopkins professor gave a group of graduate students this assignment. Go to the slums, take 200 boys between the ages of 12 and 16, and investigate their background and environment, then predict their chances for the future. The students, after consulting social statistics, talking to the boys, and compiling much data, concluded that 90% of the boys would spend some time in jail. Twenty-five years later, another group of graduate students was giving the job of testing the prediction. They went back to the same area. Some of the boys, by then men, were still there. A few had died, some had moved away, but they got in touch with 180 of the original 200. They found that only four of the group had ever been sent to jail. Why was it that these men, who had traveled in a breeding place of crime, had such a surprisingly good record. The researchers were continually told, well, there was a teacher. They pressed further and found that in 75% of the cases, it was the same woman. The researchers went to this teacher, now living in a home for retired teachers. How had she exerted this remarkable influence over that group of children? Could she give them any reasons why these boys should have remembered her? No, she said. No, I really couldn't. And then, looking back over the years, she said musingly more to herself than to her questioners, I loved those boys. Thanks for watching. If you like this story, please share and like. Click on the left card to watch the next story in the series. Or, click on the right card to access all the stories in the series.